it's Stacy Burke here, and it's a Monday, so it's time for a grocery haul. I am filming this on the 19th of December, so it's not Christmas yet. And like Mondays, I do a grocery haul. That's what I do every Monday, show you what I buy for the week. And yes, I'm wearing a Christmas sweater, one of those ugly Christmas sweaters that I got last week at Ralph's. It has been really, really cold, like freezing cold uh, yesterday, this morning, but now it's 70 degrees, so I'm burning up. I'm wearing Ugg boots, leggings. I'm sweating, but I'm going to do this haul, and then I'm going to change the shorts and a tank top, because I don't know. Here in Southern California, the weather's crazy. It goes from hot to, like, bone-chilling, like, frozen, freezing, windy cold, so... You never know what to wear. I can't wait to get this off. I need to put on something comfortable. Today's magic number is $92.03. I believe that's it. And Roy's working from home, so you might hear him come out and stuff like that. And we have a new house guest, or the same old house guest as a couple weeks ago. My friend Nancy, she has a dog. She goes out traveling. So once in a while, we take care of her. She's a mini pincher. However, before I start the haul, I had to pick up a bunch of pee. Like, she just, she has a UTI, urinary tract infection. So, she's been, I've been finding little, little wet spots on the carpet for me that I have to, like, get paper towels and pick up all the pee and then clean it with cleaner and then Lysol it, you know. I don't understand. There's the balcony with the pee pads, and then in the bathroom, she has her pee pads. So she has pee pads everywhere. I don't know why. Maybe it's because of UTI. Maybe because she's older. Maybe because it's a new place. I don't know. Maybe she's stressed. But anyway, that's how my day's going so far. Just got home from work. And now I'm the pee and the poop collector. And the grocery collector. You want to see what I got? Finally, it's under $100, huh? I keep saying I'm going to get $100. But, yes, this time it's under $100. So I'm really excited. In fact, let me see if there's room in the refrigerator. Yeah, I guess. I gotta make room later. Okay, let me show you what I got. First thing, first thing, need some crackers. So I like these. These little thins, potato thins, spinach and garlic. They're just really thin little cracker things. I know, I need to wean myself off the cracker fix fixation. Someday. Someday. Okay, this. Now, last week I made like a cheese pizza with spinach in it. So, I had to get more spinach, of course, because I like my spinach. Okay, these are all the canned cat foods for the Frankie Farter. But there's a new flavor that I haven't seen for a while, chicken and tuna. So, I, I had to get that for him because that they haven't had that Ralph's for a while. So, I want to see if he likes that. So, this is all for Frankie Farter. The Frankie Farter, the Farter Starter. The canned cat foods there. One bag down. Okay, you know how I like my box wine. I usually get the cheap box wine, but I thought, you know what? I'm gonna step it up. I'm gonna get something a little fancier, a little more expensive. You know, it is the holidays. Let me enjoy some better box wine. <laughs> I don't know. If anyone try this, it's called Provisions Everyday Fine Wines, and it's a Cabernet. It's the same price as the big one I usually get, so it's a little more pricey. But I thought, why not? It's the holidays. I want to try a better, a little better um, wine. Now, I do have some bottles, but I don't get the bottles that often because I don't like them when they're open. What are you doing? Get out of there. Get out of there. You're going to eat that plastic. You're going to eat that. Get that. Get. What are you eating? Great. I don't know. Clyde took off with something. I don't know what he's eating. He's eating something that's probably not good. Probably not good. <laughs> Let me stop this for a second. Okay, I'm back. It just turned out to be ice. I don't know how ice got in the bag. I don't know what it was, but somehow I got ice. Odd. Anyway, go back to my grocery haul. I got regular low-fat eggnog. As you know, I'm an eggnog fanatic, so I got some regular eggnog. That I can mix with some brandy. I have some brandy that I, can, I just mix it up. Uh, cheese was on sale, but they didn't have the reduced fat. So I had to get some shredded cheese that we always stock up on. And you know how I love the creamers. 
So I tried a different one. I usually don't like nut flavored creamers, but I thought I would try this. This is a uh, Southern Butter Pecan. I would try it. Something different. So I'll get the Butter Pecan creamer for my coffee. And of course, another cheese pizza. And sometimes that's my go-to when I'm hungry for something. However, last night I made, um, you know how I bought that one time, that vegan lamb vindaloo? Uh, that was good. That was good. I have a little leftovers uh, from last night when I made it, so I'm going to eat that tonight. It was like a, you know, it was like a frozen dinner, but it's vegan lamb vindaloo. <laughs> Which I know, it's fake meat, but in case you don't know, I'm a vegetarian. So, uh, okay, cheese was on sale for like a dollar eighty-eight. Like that shredded thing, and so I got some more um, slices. Cause sometimes I like these, I'll put that on the cracker. So I get slice. I got mustard, which I really like, and the Kobe Jack. So those could get on the crackers. Or if Roy wants to make a sandwich, I might as well just. Uh, Get rid of these. These coupons are probably old. I'll look at them. Alright. Then this was on sale. You know how I always get this frozen guacamole. I keep that because avocados are expensive and they spoil really quickly. So I just like to keep this in the freezer when I feel like having some avocado or some guacamole or put this on toast. I always keep this on hand in the freezer. And, oh, I forgot my cheese. Oh, my God. How many times do I forget to get my Flaming Hot Cheetos? I don't know why I always forget. And I eat them every single morning for breakfast. I think it's because I just, like, I always forget. So I usually go to Rite Aid tomorrow, which I'll probably go to Rite Aid and get the Flaming Hot Cheetos. I don't know why I always forget. I don't know why. I eat them every day. Every single morning. Of course, the bag lasts me for a whole week. I don't eat the whole bag. Like, I eat a little bit, and so that whole big bag of um, Flaming Hot Cheetos will last me for the whole week. So I still have a bag, so I'm okay. So I got some more, shower, sour, more sour cream. In fact, this stuff goes quicker than the Cheetos. I think, I think I just eat it for the sour cream, to be honest with you. I think I do. Okay, so this bag is empty. Needed more TP, so I got some Continental. This is my favorite kind. And then I also had to get more cat litter. This is eight bucks right there. That lasts a while. Oh, maybe I should do some kettlebells, huh? Let me see. Oh. <laughs> I'll do these later. I'm not gonna lie, but yeah, I do kettlebells with that. This could work out. Okay, you know how I get these for my closet? Well, it's going to be Christmas in a couple days, and then they bring out the different scents that I never see. Gingerbread. I didn't see this. Where do they hide this? Now they bring it out? Now they bring it out. Oh, well, I bought three of them. This is going to go in my closet to smell like gingerbread. Like, really? Why so late on that? I didn't see it. I go, I go there every Monday. Nope, nope, nope. Now they have it. Now they have it. So they have gingerbread, um, renews it. Of course, they never came out with a gingerbread creamer yet. I'm still waiting on that. And then for my mimosas, as you know, I always get that, my champagne. And then these are new candles. You know how I get candles? I didn't see these last time. These are brand new, called Merry Fun. Basically, it's like a vanilla. It smells like vanilla uh, cookie. It smells, yeah, it smells like a, like a sugar cookie, like vanilla. So I got two of these. These smell really good. So I got some more candles, of course. And then this was just in the bag. I must have forgot about it. A water, so I'm going to put this in here. Okay. And speaking of waters, I always get these big jug of waters. Jug of waters. I've been trying to drink more water. And then for Roy, you know, I always get him these Doritos. So I got him more Doritos. Let's put it in here. Doritos. Okay. 
goes for the Roy. Okay. And then, oh, when I had my lamb vindaloo last night, I was looking for my mint. I had, I, I knew I had some, but I don't know. Um, I might have accidentally given it away because, as you know, I give to the homeless like every one, like once a month. And I think I cleaned out my spice rack, and I may have given the mint away, and I don't know why. Because when I'm having my Indian food. Sometimes I like to put a little extra mint in it, so I had to go buy more mint. I know I had some. I know I had some, but I had to buy more mint. So I got that. And I love corn tortillas. Sometimes when I'm hungry, I just put some butter on that, warm this up, or I'll put some salsa and um, Parmesan cheese, or, or I'll put the guacamole in it. I just love corn tortillas. So I got more corn tortillas. As you know, I always get lettuce for in case I want a salad or a sandwich or something. And then I get shredded carrots because I have a bird. I have three cats, bird and a dog. So I get shredded carrots for my bird. I feed her a little bit of carrots every day. And my dog even likes them in his kibble. And I like mine in my salad. And then, of course, broccoli for the bird and for us. I always get broccoli. That's my gift every week. And last, I think this is it. This is it. This is it. This time, as you know, I get Roy fried chicken or rotisserie chicken. I've been getting a rotisserie chicken lately. But this is fried chicken. And I think it's more than eight pieces. But look at the price. It was on sale. It was on sale. So I had to get it. So he's get, he gets fried chicken this week. He gets fried chicken this week. So that is 90, what was it? $94.03. $94.03. So I'm going to go put this away. I'm going to go check for any more pea stains from Miss Maxine. And I'm going to get out of this sweater because it's 71 degrees now. It's like hot. Like my feet are sweaty and they're gross. Like extremely gross. So you're probably going to see this after uh, Christmas. So I hope everyone had a Merry Christmas. Everyone had a happy, 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 happy holiday. Uh, so until next time, to all my stays, good dance, and my briquettes. Peace.